What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory Update 7. Yes, we are still on Update 7, I know Update 8 is already released on the Experimental Branch, but I do not want to switch in between. Uh, right now to have to switch back to the official branch, I need to move that pole or something. Uh, yeah, so what we're gonna do this episode is we as you remember last episode we set up the borax mine the bauxite mine and oh i can see borax bauxite <laughs> bauxite mine uh to start the aluminum production uh this episode we are going to try to build i'm not sure if we're gonna have enough time to build the production area for that mine but we're gonna at least try to get the transportation of that ore down to the main base into one of my designated areas where I want to set up that production area for aluminum or aluminium as some of you guys say. And we have some lag there. Ah, uh, whoa. Holy crap. You guys may uh, wonder why last week's ep well, this episode was supposed to be last week. I skipped a week there because last week I actually had to uh, remove a teeth <laughs> and I was on antibiotics and painkillers. So I was a bit out of it, so I decided not to uh, record anything at the moment. It was a weird feeling. Alright, so... Uh, I just thought of this before I started recording. What we're gonna do is use a truck line. I should have a truck available. Or I can just build one. We use one of the big trucks. The actual one that's called a truck. And... Uh, one of these areas I was gonna reutilize for this. Um, so there's a line here already. Somewhere wrong here, I was actually going to utilize. I don't have any trucks going on there anymore because there's a train line now. But what I can do... I can do this to make life a bit more... a bit easier. Um, I can put the... Aluminum production area right over the abyss. I need a lot of freaking concrete to do that though. Or I can put it somewhere here. You know what? I might as well put it right here on this little dunk slope. I have no trucks going on here, so I can put it around here. All we're gonna have to do is uh, let me go in my build menu and queue up the stuff that I need to get. Before we go into the production stuff, we are going to have to set up a line to bring the stuff down. And I have to run a power line up there, which is the hard part. So I'm going to need... Transportation. I'm going to need a two truck stations. I also need a truck. I don't think I have one on me. And a bunch of freaking cables. So let's go get the stuff we need just to build the trucks and stuff. And some a bunch of extra cables so that we can route a power line up to the mine. I should also pick up some iron sheets and some some iron sheets and some uh, concrete so that I can build a foundation to shorten the route I may also in future episode build a hyperloop connection up there Cables. I was wondering why I came up here for, but I just remember this is a couple factory so I can get cables here.
No, I will continue for cables. Apparently, I don't, which is a bit annoying. Right, we got the cables, we need three more heavy modular frames. Uh, that would be this way. And we need 30 modular frames. We can even get that right now. Yeah, have grass on me. Me just <laughs> can ride with a tractor down to the steel factory. That's where the modular frames are. It came just in time for me to jump on it. It was weird. There goes the train heading for some modular frames. Oh. I forgot I did this shit. I'm not sure how much more uh, frames we have right now. I know we kind of have a lack of that right now. I did already upgrade the modular frame factory twice, so we shouldn't have much of a lack. But as I'm using them to create, uh, I think there's one more floor. Wait, I'm on the top floor. What the frick? Yep, we do have a lot of modular frames. Still that. And that. Alright. I was supposed to pick up steel, let's pick up that one then. No steel sheets, iron sheets, my bad. Ah, oh, I need fuel.
Uh, while I'm heading back on foot, let me remove that little um, bird pen that I <laughs> kind of built the part of the shot. That was weird. I should have taken the train up to the Mojo Frames factory. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna probably construct the Mojo Frames myself. I just, just need a little bit more. I still know that that's an indestructible rock. We need to pass by the weapon structure to get some more explosive free bar. Where did I pack my oh never mind, found it. Damn. These guys need to be um overclocked a bit. Yeah. No, I have some more glass back for them. I'm going to collect some more power shards. Power slugs. Um, did I have anything down here overclock that I can on? I don't think I did. Is there like a power stock or something somewhere around here?
I'm not sure. I have to look out for power stocks on my journey. I do have enough to, to expand these out and get more production, but I don't think that's necessary right now. Steal that. Couple more. I mean, if I stole that too. Six more. Four more. Alright, we got everything, let's go build our station. Well, that helped. Let's see. Now this station a little bit up this way. Fuel in it. I have to run the fuel and power and stuff down here. Rip. Uh. Alright, let's get into a bit of a bit of montage while I route the power and stuff down here. While the fuel. Because power is right here.
บายบาย Alright, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna run the power line as I'm gonna walk back. I just wanna do that one time. Hopefully I have enough to get it further than I did. Uh, we may take the route on running it through the uh, cave or not because there's another way if I can build a bridge uh, there it'd make it shorter because that pulls us up right by the self um which is this way and, uh, to pull us up right by the um sofa I hear a beast okay never mind go back to the cave Very dark in those guys. I have to get rid of these guys somehow. I will make our way back to the main bay. Oh, you friggin' hell. And he saw me. I was not prepared. Oh frick, oh frick, run, 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 run. Oh my god, run. Mm. Ah! This is why you bring your ammo.
Um, right, so I'm gonna have to uh, take the I put a tube connection up to the weapons factory, get some explosive rebar. Uh, what's upstairs? Come back down. Uh, might have to take my explorer up there. I could have dodged with that guy pretty easy if I had ex any explosive by my inventory, but I didn't. Well, what I can do, I can come back and walk back up running the um, but no, I don't have the cables on me. Mm. I just got to the weapons factory. Uh, got the explosive rebar and head back now. It'll be a bit tricky. I had explosives on me. Shit. Just remember they had explosives on me. Damn it. I could have dealt with that guy easily if I remember they had explosives on me. This is a bit longer episode than I thought because uh, at this point of recording it's already been close an hour which is usually where I cut off my recording time so I may have about two build montage or two um, time lapse sections of this video I did not expect to die there, honestly. Where's my... That far down? Holy crap.
Alright, it might take a little bit of time for me to run this thing. This episode is going to be an interesting episode to edit. Because it's a bit longer than my usual recording session. Uh, by the way, patrons, you'd get access to the full uncut video and also get access to the save file for this episode and previous episodes and other episodes in the future. So, you guys on YouTube, if you'd like to support the channel on Patreon, you, that's some of the stuff you guys will get access to.
just have to go back to this other truck station to finish off this time. Really? guys that's going to be it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed uh i just go around fixing these things off camera see you guys in the next one uh next episode we'd be setting up the factory for the box site and aluminum production stuff if you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys in the next one i'm out peace